Hello everybody, Zach here. Welcome back to GTA 5 and welcome back to Chase Me. We're going to be using this grotty monster truck today, which is an awesome mod. Link in the description if you want to get it for your game. I've got it in 5M here. Let's go. Oh, Cletus, you're going to be excited to drive this today. Listen to that. Obviously using the monster truck sounds. This thing is going to be awesome. Oh my gosh, it's so fast. It's got the four wheel steering that we've come to expect from any monster truck in here. This thing handles awesome. And uh, I'm pretty sure it's going to be awesome and it chase me. At least I hope so. I just want to drive around Sandy here for a little bit and take advantage of the fact that we can just drive up or down anything we want as well as crush anything we want. This thing is absolutely ridiculous, but I love it. it. Comes with a bunch of different liveries. It's pretty cool that the light bar actually gets added on with this livery. That's not an add on or anything. Pretty awesome mod. So let's get some stars here in Sandy and see how it goes. All right, we got two stars in Sandy Shores driving into the Grand Sonora Desert here. Hopefully they'll be able to catch us. Well, at least catch us to, to you know, get caught up to us, to chase us in the first place. Because we're able to just drive on whatever surfaces we like. This is honestly a perfect vehicle for me. The perfect vehicle for off-roading it, for zacking it. I love it. But the question is... Can they even find me in the first place? How dumb are the 5M cops? Hope you guys had a great weekend um, and a great start to the week. And here we go. <laughs> Look at the damage just these tires do to their car. And <laughs> You're not going to be coming with us, buddy. Man, this thing gets up and goes too. That's the thing that, you know, Monster trucks usually aren't going anywhere at speed. Is there in real life, have there, has there been a monster truck chase? Like, how do you stop a monster? I guess you shoot out the tires. Let's be honest. You shoot out the tires. Also, you wear your seatbelt, Cletus. <laughs> That's not good. I gotta put on my seatbelt. All right, seatbelts on for Cletus. Let's get the hell out of here before they start shooting at us. <laughs> yeah, you also got to remember that uh, a little bit top heavy monster trucks. Well, at least, you know, with the handling in this game. I don't know what handling line this is using. I'm assuming it's using another monster trucks handling line. But yeah, an awesome model overall, uh, regardless of, you know, what it has to use. That's that's just what it is. That's just what it do. Oh, my gosh. I really got to learn how to drive, though. We're not even getting away from two stars and they're barely able to keep up with me at this point. Oh, it just sounds so good. I feel like we just got to drive it off. We lost two stars already. It was that easy. Barely even Adam to begin with. Okay. I'm going to drive around in here and try for three and see how that goes. All right. Three stars at the Redwood Lights racetrack. Shouldn't have drove that way. Drove right into that trailer. But I feel like this is perfect. Oh my gosh, they're sending the... Look at all the blips. There they come. Hopefully you guys can uh, keep up with me. Only problem is now we have a helicopter too. And the heli is not going to treat us well. Yes. This thing just... This thing... I mean, mind you. Oh no, we're losing multiple doors. Hey, it cool that it exposes the engine though that's pretty awesome hey they actually said I was driving a monster truck too that's cool good job dispatch I guess it makes sense if that's you know what it's coded in as oh we got a dump truck in here dump truck a uh, great truck Ted report a little bit of that not only for posterity but you know in case that makes for a good thumbnail or for a good movie moment. Okay, you know what? I'm going back. And here they come. <laughs> here we go. We're just going to drive right over them. Okay. Not as easy when you don't have any speed behind you. 
I love GTA physics. It's partially sarcastic. Partially truthful. It's like great for an open world game, but at the same time, like a lot of things, right? But how do you do it? How do you do all of it at once? What other stupid cars would you love to see as monster trucks in the GTA universe? Because honestly, this is something that I didn't need or didn't know I needed until I saw it. <laughs> and I think uh, that security guard stuck behind the fence there. Let's go through here. And this is beautiful. You can just jump off of anything. Have no problem landing it. I love it as we drive around <laughs> the jail here. We were about to lose three stars, but instead we're going to just have to ramp off of you. And we've lost all of our doys. Doys. All of our doy doys. So that's going to not be good for if they're shooting at me. Shooting at Cletus. I'm going to take the highway here. See, the beautiful thing, too, is I can just drive right over that, too. I don't even need to use any of the turnarounds or anything. This thing is great. It really, really is. I'm doing a bad job at showing it off and showing off its capabilities as I usually do. I will say that. You give it too much gas, you're falling on your back. Definitely if you lose grip in those front tires. But it's beautiful. I can just drive right over them too. Don't even have to worry about that. Dundry. Watch out. I would love if the lights and sirens worked on this, though. That would be incredible. Would it be pointless? Yes. The fact that it's integrated into a livery is great. All right. Sorry about your sorry about your homes, hippies. Trying to drive through here. Oh, no. We got another helicopter on us. Again, it doesn't matter where we drive, right? Why am I, why am I trying to stick the roads and other road-like things when we can just drive up here by the, you know, the airfield? <laughs> The wind field. You just don't even have to stop. Police are really talkative on the radio today for some reason. Okay, we're going to probably have to get out of here before they locate us down to this. Just keep hitting all the trees. Every tree that's here, I continue to hit it. So let's get out of here. Jump right off here. I'm gonna try to avoid trees and etc. And here we are, back on the road. I feel like we made absolutely no progress. That being said, though, you know what? Oh, they're they're coming back. Uh, I wonder if I can get down here and kind of avoid their line of sight. Nope. I'm in a monster truck. What was I thinking? Avoid their line of sight. Look at this thing. How could you avoid anything in this thing? But they can't do this. This should have been... I should have done an off-road. I haven't... It's been a while since I've done an off-road challenge where I've had to stay off-road. You know, the, the road is lava kind of thing. But... This might have been the vehicle to do it in, but hey, I feel like half of the time we have done it. We just climbed up here. There's no way unless they send a helicopter to get us up here. No way for them to get to us. And uh, exactly what I said is what is happening. They are sending a helicopter over here. Watch out. Okay. Uh, there are no roads or anything over here. Which makes it perfect for me to kind of sneak down through here. We lost three stars. Beautiful. I would say, let us get repaired. And then let us go to four stars and see how that goes. Because honestly, you know, even with my poor driving, this thing and its ability to go anywhere has enabled us to, you know, get away from the cops anywhere. All right. We got four stars. Got our vehicle repaired. And, uh... I should probably not drive right into the water immediately. 
That would be, probably be smart. Oh, these rocks over here. Didn't realize I was going to be doing a snow runner and GTA cross over here. Wasn't trying, you know, but it's what has ended up happening. Let's go up and over this. If I can, if I can get the grip and I think I can. This is GTA physics. Oh no. Oh no, 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 no. You lose grip or something for a second and you just, you can't do it. Get to it. Put it on there and let's go. Driving straight up the side of the mountain. And here we go. We're coming back to the wind farm. Okay. They are shooting at us from the helicopter. I'm going to drive this way actually. And we're going to go towards the, uh, plant over here and maybe try to hop on the highway. Let's see. Oh, yeah. What? 60 miles an hour in the air. Okay. Let's hope we can make this jump. Oh, no. We're going into the crevasse. Didn't want to go into this crevasse. The helicopters sounded like they followed us. Try to get through here, sneak through here. I'm just gonna try to get out. Oh, there's a lot of stuff happening on that bridge. Wow, yep. All of the sheriff department is at the bridge. So we gotta get moving. Oh, there looks like there was a uh, roadblock there or something. Now the question is, can this drive over that? No, it cannot, but it can it can <laughs> do enough damage. Stay with it here. Okay, let's go into regular lanes here. I honestly don't know how we're gonna get away from four, to be honest. It's one of those things where even if you do go off road, they've got the helicopter helicopters to follow you. And they're just shooting at me through the Oh, they're getting me. They're getting Cletus through the back window. No, there's so many. <laughs> land it, land it, land it. Yeah, you will land it. Okay. I'm going to go for avoidance now, even though, you know, every opportunity I've gotten so far, I've hit everything, including the cars. That was a, actually a way better move than I thought it would be. So we are going to try our best here to avoid, survive, and lose. Tunnel, tunnel, tunnel. Train, train track, train track tunnel, everybody. That's, I think, where we're going to have to go. Man, this thing just has, it has too much power, honestly. But I think this will work out for us. Can't send a helicopter into the tunnel. You can send units, though, but I feel like they don't usually drive into here, so... Oh man, the sound. Okay, I think we're gonna have lost four stars in here. I had hoped I could. Yeah, I'm gonna say, oh no, I see them out there. I hear them too. Oh, worst case, we lose the four. We're going to go to five, and I think that's going to be the ultimate impossible task. Oh, they're literally looking <laughs> right there. You see them up there? No, 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 no. No, thank you. <gasps> okay, there's four lost. So let's do five um, because I kind of cheated on them, you know, to get into here, to sneak into a tunnel and just get away. So let's do five. Let's go. Five stars. And we're going to be down here by the river, which 
enables us just to shoot off here. Drive through the river a little bit. It slows us down a little bit, but not too much. What do you guys think? Not only this chase me, but also this vehicle. I think <laughs> the fact that I can just drive over nearly anything. Pretty incredible. But also, this has great speed and agility for a monster truck, you know? As I just bash it into the wall. Are they going to be trying to come down here? Well, who cares? We're going to be exiting here. All right, lots of gunshots happening. Lots of units honing in on my position here. I don't know if the city is going to be beneficial to me or not. I don't think it will be, to be honest. But you know what? Maybe... Maybe alleyways and other stuff will actually be more efficient than I would think. Hide my visibility a little bit, you know? That being said, it is super hard to drive through <laughs> um, anywhere small. And they're going to be coming to the construction site here. Problem too. Your wheels stick out farther than you think. Cletus has taken some damage. I don't think I've given myself health at all, though. I mean, I've repaired the vehicle, but I, I haven't given myself health at all, so Cletus is hanging in there. Oh no, those are going to be spike strips. This, I don't think, has spikeable tires, poppable tires. I don't think any of the monster trucks do. Ugh. Going around the entire city, hitting the bus stop. Okay. He's over there. I guess between me hitting that and whatever shot sounded like it happened nearly at the same exact time, I was taken out. All right. So five stars, honestly, you know, the vehicle's not exploded or anything, but Cletus obviously didn't make it through. Um, I think this is an awesome car for Chase Me. Awesome car in general. Like I said, link is in the description for the mod. If you want to pick it up for yourself, pretty, pretty awesome. Hope you guys enjoyed this video and I hope you enjoy Chase Me's as well as Mod Showcases. If you do, please like and subscribe. I really do appreciate it. There's also a YouTube thank feature now, which allows you to give uh, money. Appreciate people taking advantage of that already. Thank you so much. Um, you know, thank you for your continued support here through 2022. I know we're almost halfway through the year, which is crazy, but uh, really appreciate all the support. And uh, I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye.